What's up? <laughs> we're um, we're on Sutherland in Echo Park, pretty much across the street from the uh, previous Sutherland. <laughs> Do you want to your right? All right, I got we'll it. We'll get it later. <laughs> Fours and five. Anyway, that was like our seventh TIC community, was it? I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, something was, like that. Last it was year, awesome. it's four, four. It was four bungalows. Mm. Um, anyway, that's a TIC community right across the street. And then this is our second one on Sutherland. Six units, three duplexes, <clears throat> right up the street from Combi. Eggplant katsu. I don't know if your mommy made veggies like this, but oh damn, so good. So good. All right, let's go. These decks will be exclusive. Everybody will have basically their own little private patio deck. We really pushed hard for these decks because before it was, well, I guess it was a struggle trying to decide what to do here. Because on one hand, it was really cool to have this like lush mm -hmm. courtyard with a bunch of vegetation. <laughs> what? Vegetation. <laughs> Sorry. We, we kind of had this vision of having these decks, like a, each unit having its own little deck. Mm -hmm. um, and it came out really nicely. Like, I think, w so we compromised. We did a little bit of, we left the trees. Yeah. Um, and I think the added, natural tone of the of the wood really adds to the sort of that, that woodsy element, that natural element out here really feels outdoorsy. They built this too high. They're yeah, going to cut it down. It's going to come down to like. That's the other thing is we wanted yeah. it to feel open. We didn't want it to be like all these enclosed mm -hmm. yards because you kind of wanted to keep it open and have that community space. Yeah. Um, so but, you could be out here just like reading a book and then someone could be like right there just like on Instagram. Let's be honest, nobody reads books anymore. <laughs> so this one is the... Uh, <laughs> What's up? <laughs> That's normally how I enter every unit story. <laughs> so, this one's a two bedroom. This is like the only two bedroom, like legitimate two bedroom here. Everything else is one bedroom. <laughs> With a bonus room. <laughs> We might market them as two bedrooms, but yeah, this is this is what would feel <laughs> most spacious. I think this will be this is our definitely our largest unit. This is two actual mm -hmm. bedrooms with closets in it. The other ones are yeah, one bedrooms with bonus rooms. We just swapped little, the light out. I like it. You like it? Yeah. We had a long discussion about this. We have long discussions about so many things, but like little do you we know the we details. fought for this <laughs> basket light because yeah. it was. It, what did they have here before? It was like just something hard and metal. Something metal and strong, like too harsh. Wow! So no brackets oh. on the. It's big. A lot of work. That's a lot of work. How you doing? Good. Go in, my friend. All right. And then we have the other bedroom. <laughs> I feel like this one might be more of the bedroom bedroom, and that one you would use as like guest or office. This is cool. I like this unit. I know, baby. You like them all. <laughs> no offense. <laughs> yeah, this one's good. Okay, and then you've got a shower, completely redone. Okay. Nothing. All right. We've got five more units to show you. Okay, so this is a two bedroom, then there's a little one bedroom next door. So you have this whole deck, and we didn't show you, but you actually have, there's a yard in front as well, which is awesome. This, this probably has the most amount of yard space, that unit. And that one, that first unit, I think that's 1375. Square yeah. feet? No, uh, the address. address. That's listed for. Oh, they replaced the light in here too. Yeah. You okay with it? <laughs> yeah, it's okay. And this one's gonna be the smallest one, so this will be the most affordable one. Yeah. And it also be. has a window you can crawl out of. They all have. <laughs> <laughs> We're obsessed with windows you can crawl out of. <laughs> Ever since we did our time in Juvie. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> the things that <laughs> make, us happy. make us happy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. The one bedroom, it's so cute. And they they had to like build out this closet. Like they punched it out and, cause there was no closet space. It, this was a studio before. And they made yeah. it into a one bedroom. Yeah, you're standing where the kitchen <coughs> used to be. The kitchen used to be, right. The, this is all an addition right here, just so they could add some mm -hmm. more closet space. A little more closet space, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks really good. I think we did all right. Hey. Go ahead, dale, dale. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, todo bien. No yeah, it's looking great. Yeah, and then you've got, Washer dryer in all the units. Yeah. And a cute bathroom. It's just sort of a simple clean bathroom. I don't know if you want to take a look at that. Did you yeah. see this here? Small 
but mighty. Whoa. Whoa. Look at that. Fancy. We did not order that. Uh, the Danny contractor. Maybe? Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. Okay, let's go out the window. Sweet. I don't think Kyle's gonna. Okay, let's. We're going through the window. Is <laughs> that see pork katsu sandwich has kind of got me a little heavier than normal. You got okay. Yeah, you gotta hit some squats, babe. <laughs> So we haven't seen that unit yet, but now we're walking into 1405. This is um, sort of like a bedroom and a half, I'd like to call it. I always tell people that we pick out the cabinet knobs and like literally we picked out the cabinet knobs for this property because yeah. we had them swap them out. What were they before? They were black. They were black and, and we, it, just it was seemed too, a little it was too, too black. It was too much for me. Yeah. It was too sharp. So this is the like sort of the bonus office space, which is also going to be a pass through to laundry and bathroom. It's not a full bedroom by any means, but it's it, you know, just a sort of additional space if you need that. And then this is obviously dining room table would <coughs> go there, living space would be here. You have an open kitchen. And then you've got your bedroom on this end. Can't climb out the window. Can't climb. I, I can give you a boost if you want to give it a shot. <laughs> yeah. So we're we're in Echo Park, a block from Sunset. North of Sunset, yeah. It's walking distance to so many things. Like mm -hmm. this is a really great location. Yeah, it's blocks from everything. It's blocks from everything, yeah. Okay, okay there's more, there's more. Hang, hang with us. Two more hours, tops, we're so close. So this is gonna be common walkway. This will be common. So the upstairs unit that does not have a patio will have this. And then I'll show you that here in just a second. You wanna show this downstairs? Oh, the doors are look at awesome. this brick. Yeah, so do you know this brick was actually salvaged from the posts? Oh, cool. And we cool. had to take down because they weren't safe. Yeah. Yeah, so that's what this brick is. Nice. Yeah. So, so this unit comes with a private yard and this like bonus room, office space. Yeah, which they drywalled and put the floor in. So all of this goes to that downstairs unit and this and this. But so you have your own storage space here that would come. And then you have this whole planter with the seating area would go with that upstairs unit as well. This is 1375 Sutherland Community. Yeah. We did it. We're really excited. In under three hours. Pricing is like... So the studio is going to be, I think that that's going to have a three in front of it. Everything else is either going to have... A, it's you like, know, high three, like high three, like 375 or something. Yeah. To like 600? To, to 600, yeah. For, for that, for that, yeah. For the two bedroom in front? Yeah, exactly. And then the other one bedrooms are somewhere like... Everybody gets one parking spot. Everybody gets one parking spot, yep. There's ductless in all the units. Yep, we did mini splits. Yeah. Sweet. So this property was um, was going to be demoed. That's right, so a, a, a group of um, uh, owners um, had purchased the property, had removed all the units from rental market, and they were actually going to demolish everything, as I understand it, and create small lot subdivision. Homes. Yeah. And I don't know what happened. I don't know if they couldn't get on the same page or what. They went they bankrupt or something, or like they had to sell. I have it no was... idea. But they sold, and then we were able to. Search, search. Buildings were in pretty rough shape. The lot was in pretty rough shape, but I could see that the potential was here. So they couldn't rent the units out. The right. cl our clients who bought it couldn't rent it out because it had been removed it, from it the market. Been removed so we so decided really to salvage all the buildings. And sell them. And sell them. TIC. Yeah, so it'll be a community of six. So instead of a small lot subdivision with high-end homes, we right. now have six um, middle-income homes. Right. Yeah. 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 No, definitely. definitely more, yeah. Definitely more affordable. Definitely more affordable. Not low-income, but definitely more affordable, yeah. So yeah, and I think, I think it's, a, it's a great space. Snail, squid. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you got to get the snail squid. <laughs>